Hi everyone. What I want to do now is that I want to talk about how to use the channels um, a little differently. And we're going to use the channels and we're going to assign CB radio channel numbers uh, to the channels that correspond to that channel's frequency. And the reason I'm doing this is to show you that you don't have to assign frequencies to channels one after the other. It doesn't have to be next one's two, next one's three, next one's four. You can actually jump all over the numbers up to, I think, 63 or 68, whatever the limits are. So in this case, it would kind of make sense that if you wanted to have a frequency, let's say channel 19, maybe this is in your car uh, and you just want to see what's going on on the highway. You could just assign that frequency, which is 27.185, to channel 19 in memory, and that would make sense. The other thing I wanted to point out is that in a previous video, I had said that I wish that the hand mic was backlit. Well, dumb me, the hand mic is backlit. And the reason why I missed it was because the lighting in my office is very bright, and I think probably too bright. So I didn't see it. Um, anyhow, so let's look at this. If you don't know how to assign a frequency to the channel, go back to my other video on memories and it's real quick and real easy. But in this case, we are now in the memory function. Right there, VM is between the VFO and the channel. It's the same thing as if you push it right here. So let's press that until we get to the channels right there. Remember in the CIGU, CH00, has to be filled in first. Once you do that, then you can assign frequencies to any channel number you want up to the limit. Also, I've assigned the movement or the change of channels and frequencies to the up and down buttons. Originally, I had it volume down, volume up. Uh, what I did was to reassign it to the, the channel uh, selector, if you will. All right, so right now I'm on channel 00. If I press up, I get to CB channel 1, which is 26,965. Now, if I press it again, it jumps right to channel 4, which is 27,000. I press it again, it's channel 9, channel 10, 14, and up to 19. Uh, and then if you press it again, it goes right back around to the first memory channel, which is 00. zero. So that's a neat feature. I think it's probably common with most radios, but I'm just glad you can do it on the Seago. So again, just wanted to show you how you can use the memory channels to correspond to something logical. The CB radio logical? Well, anyway, I'll leave that to someone else, um, to their channel numbers. Again, thanks for watching. Please hit the subscribe button, and we'll keep digging into the Seagoo G90 until we're all uh, sick of it. Nah, it's a nice radio. Bye.